Bitcoin and cryptocurrency prices have been under pressure through most of 2022, with the Bitcoin price losing almost 20% so far this year. Subscribe now to Forbes Crypto Asset and Blockchain Advisor and successfully navigate the latest crypto price crash. The Ethereum price and other major cryptocurrencies have also fallen sharply as bullish investors balk at the prospect of rising interest rates and a slowdown in pandemic era stimulus mail. Now, that's the billionaire Elon Musk, who sent shockwaves through the crypto world when he added $1. 5 billion of Bitcoin to Tesla's balance sheet last year, has said he still owns and won't sell his Bitcoin, Ethereum and Dogecoin, advising people not to hold dollars when inflation is high. Want to stay ahead of the bear market and understand what Fed interest rate hikes mean for crypto? Sign up now for the free Crypto Codex. A daily newsletter for crypto investors and the crypto curious as a general principle. For those looking for advice from this thread, it is generally better to own physical things like a home or stock in companies you think make good products, than dollars when I. I still own and won't sell my Bitcoin, Ethereum or Doge, for what it's worth. Musk, who'd asked his Twitter followers what their thoughts were about the probable inflation rate over next few years, was replying to Saylor, the chief executive of business intelligence software company MicroStrategy. MicroStrategy, a decades-old software company, has pivoted to a Bitcoin acquisition vehicle over the last couple of years. MicroStrategy now holds just over 125,000 bitcoins, currently valued at about $4.8 billion. Musk, who's become one of the most divisive figures in the crypto community over the last year, has repeatedly called for upgrades to the meme-based Bitcoin rival Dogecoin, suggesting last year Doge could work with Ethereum to beat Bitcoin hands down, while Musk has said he personally owns Bitcoin. Sign up now for Crypto Codex a free, daily newsletter for the crypto curious last week, the latest U.S. inflation numbers showed consumer price inflation rocketed to a four-decade high as red, fuel and food costs climbed even before Russia's invasion of Ukraine triggered a sharp rise in energy price.